I was asked uh, this evening by a friend of mine uh, why I still do uh, still do the Life Team program every uh, every Sunday night, and that they were wondering if my time would be better spent with people my own age watching the the Bears game uh, on a Sunday rather than preparing to do Life Teen. And, uh, I wanted to record this and I hope this works and uh, answer that question for you guys because you know we talked tonight about the power of art and beauty and why we should let ourselves be moved why we should be open and let beauty move us back to the source back to the desires of our heart um, to ultimately the, the God uh, Jesus Christ who loves us and I guess I want you to realize that I continue to do life team because I am moved. I say to you guys, let yourselves be moved, um, but you move me. And I see the beauty of Christ in you. I see God's love manifest. You know, I see with my own eyes uh, what it is to be in such a beautiful world uh, where I can see where I can see divine grace uh, you know you guys really are something you know I see you all I see the compassion you have for one another the kindness how you welcome the stranger etc and how we just a few of us you know a couple of a couple of lame you know college students or recently graduated college students we just want to share with you the truth of, of Christ and, 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 and the power of his love for you and, and the mercy that he offers humanity and, and the beauty um, of, of life in general and the reason why we do it why we do it you know we want you to be moved by him but you move us and I don't ever want you to forget that we, you know, Christ and his beauty draws me to him. I, I cannot help but be fascinated by Christ. I cannot help but be compelled to my own destiny um, with him because he is destiny. And because his life and light and beauty dwells in you, you guys cannot help but fascinate me. I cannot help but care about you and your destiny. And I just want you to realize that, that we continue to do it because we are ever moved, ever fascinated, ever drawn by the beauty of God, the light of Christ, and the power of his redemption made manifest in the lives of other human beings. And so, we hope that Christ moves you, but know that you move us, and that we will pray for you throughout this week, and pray that we continue to be moved by the spirit of that same Christ, whose, whose love, whose love conquers the world, and saves the heart of man. Um, anyway, I'll uh, be praying for you this week. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Uh, good night, guys, and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful week.